Peter Falk spars with John Cassavetes. The relentless lieutenant slowly corners the murderous symphony conductor. Both men dead now. I once saw Mr. Falk on a metal chair he sat in front of a sandwich shop on San Vicente Boulevard. He was disheveled, unkempt, confused in expression, all the results of Alzheimer's disease. I knew the signs. He had still a little light left in his eyes. From a distance, I spoke to him nervously, too quiet. I'm a fan. It garnered no response. I continued much louder. I read your book. You read my book, he echoed, and seemed to awake from his cognitive slumber. He smiled warmly and raised one hand high in the air, a salute to the sky. His signature gesture, a parting gift to forever treasure, until I forget.